In this brand new video, you will now discover conditional statements in Python, its syntax and how to properly use logical and comparison operators, so you can control the execution flow of your program. Please, do not forget to smash that like button, for the YouTube algorithm, since it does really help supporting us, and providing new free content, once a week. Are you interested to be part of this community? All the links are in the description below. Now, let's play this video. If, else statements. You know how to use an if statement, to conditionally execute a single statement, or a block of several statements. It is now time to find out what else you can do, to control the execution flow of your program. Sometimes, you want to evaluate a condition, and take one path if it is true, so that one thing or more can happen, but specify an alternative path when it is not, and something else happens. This, is accomplished with an else clause, which executes a statement in case all the tested expressions are false, in the default case. To understand the control flow of an if else statement, take a look at the flow chart of how the execution takes place. If expression, statements, else, statements. An if expression is followed by an indented block of statements. If the expression is true, the first block of statements is executed, then the second is skipped. But, after the if statement, there is an optional else statements which is followed by another indented block of statements. When the if expression is false, the first block of statements is skipped, then, the second executed instead. There is no limit on the number of statements that can appear under the two clauses of an if else statement, but there has to be at least one statement in each block. Either way, execution then resumes after the second block. Also note that both suites of statements are defined by indentation, as described earlier. Example. Great. Let's get back and say you wanted to go a step further, in the previous example. Imagine you wanted to display a statement, when the total score was actually within the range, less than 100. Cause this is exactly when the if else statement would help. When recording the score for a certain coursework, you want to add, together, the points for the theory part, and also the practical part to get the total score. If the total score is greater than 100, you want to display a warning message. And if it is less than 100, display a, score valid, message. Here is a solution to this problem. Declare two variables, score theory equals 40, score practical equals 45. Then write the if else statement, to check whether the total score is valid, or print a warning message, when it is not. If, score theory plus score practical greater than 100. Print, please check the input, score exceeds total possible score. Else, print, score validated, your total is, score theory plus score practical. If you like this video, please, do not forget to give a thumb up, and subscribe our channel. Digital Academy, learn free. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Like, comment, and share.